Hello and welcome Virgo. Let's take a look at your cards. Be sure to connect in with your own intuition and just take what resonates and leave what doesn't. I hope you're all doing well. Let's take a look at your first card. Miracles. Beautiful. Have faith that your miracle is on its way. Your prayers have been answered. Surrender the how. Are you seeing a miracle in your life at the moment unfolding? It looks like someone is. That's amazing. Have you had faith and has this faith? How are you receiving because of this faith? Your prayers are being answered or have been answered and you can see it in real time in your life. That's amazing. Beautiful card. And with this, with this energy, with this card, I'll also mention that you might be getting ready for some unexpected changes. Balance. Take time to relax. Indulge a little more or less and set boundaries with your work. Are you needing to set boundaries with someone? Maybe it is with your work or some, some other situation. Indulging perhaps a little more or a little less to bring that balance into your life. Or is it in your life that you're needing to bring equilibrium partnership teamwork will give you a better result so are you recognizing that you're needing to bring someone else on board or a partnership can strengthen in some way are you finding trustworthy people to partner with now this may resonate in terms of work business of course but it might also be personal relationships trustworthy people build up talented support team Strength. This challenge will make you stronger. Are you going through a challenge at the moment? If you are, you are also feeling this strength with this challenge and you are overcoming. You will get through to the other side. Look for the gifts in this situation. Look for the, that silver lining. Look for the blessings there. And perhaps that's what you are already doing. Maybe you are seeing a gift or an opportunity that's coming out of a struggle that you're involved in. Clarity. So we move from a difficulty. We move, move from a situation where there's darkness, where there's upheaval, where there's heavy emotions perhaps. And we're moving into clarity, moving into abundance through having clarity fun are you recognizing that perhaps there's, there's a need to have more fun in your life maybe this ties into balance okay so maybe having fun uh, socializing with people that you enjoy to be with um, maybe doing something solo that brings you satisfaction and joy is going to bring more balance into your life. Angels, your guardian angel is right by your side and you may have been receiving guidance. You may have been receiving inspirations or ideas. Perhaps your guardian angel is bringing clarity to your mind and your situation. Compassion. Maybe this is needed rather than having a hardened heart. Being conscious of bringing compassion into a situation, a communication might be important. Perhaps being more compassionate with yourself about your Decisions or the past, perhaps. Also, if you're going through a struggle, 
angels having compassion for you. Your guardian angel holds compassion for you. Take time for yourself. This might be needed. Enjoy relaxation. So enjoy these activities of relaxation because they're going to nurture your soul. That might resonate. Perhaps this is something that you're aiming for, something you're wanting to do. Magnify your intentions. Choose a specific goal to work toward. Perhaps you feel that your energy is spread out among too many ideas or too many people or things. And you know that you need to bring your focus back to the key intention and maybe let your angels, let God help with something. So releasing some control in some way. Open your heart. Your potential for greater love rests in opening your heart. Blockages and wounds from your past will be healed and perhaps you're working on that. You're working on healing the past and you'll be met with a true passion, with the true passion you seek. Laughter. So you have the card of fun as well as laughter. So you might be expecting a wonderful connection where there's going to be upliftment, where there's going, maybe it's a party or a gathering. Uplift yourself and those around you through loving laughter. The full moon, completion, culmination, something to, coming to a finalization, but it's a it's a good finishing. It's something that you're um, that you're happy with ultimately by the looks of it. A big smile here, something you're happy with. Travel journey path and location. Are you relocating or are you planning to travel or? Perhaps you're on a journey right now. How does this card resonate for you? Stairs, direction and timing. Do you feel that you're wanting to move in a new direction? You're wanting to make changes in some way, um, but the timing is coming into play in some respect. Maybe it's the right time and you feel that for a completion. So you can change direction. Obsidian, grounding, shielding and void. Are you needing to put up some boundaries, barriers? Um, are you needing to ground yourself or to shield or protect in some respect? Mm, perhaps that is true. The Eight of Cups. In each loss, there is a gain. Perhaps you've had a loss or a disappointment, a challenge recently, um, but there's also a recognition that with this loss, there is a gain. As in every gain, there is a loss. And with each ending comes a new beginning. So there's that cycle, there's that completion, and a new beginning may be starting for you in your life. A man's true wealth is the good he does in this world. So giving to others, being of service. This might resonate in terms of your job, your career, your business. Maybe you're wanting to, do, to be involved with this energy a bit more. This is also the Six of Pentacles is also connected into balance. Things becoming balanced. The Four of Pentacles. Ordinary riches can be stolen. Real riches cannot. So maybe you're evaluating your life, reevaluating things. And what are the real riches in your life? In your soul are infinitely precious things that cannot be taken from you. My sun sets to rise again. Something has come to an end. Completion, finalization. That message is there again for you. Um... But you also understand and know that your sun, you know, is going to rise again. 
The five of pentacles, resolve to be thyself. And know that he who finds himself loses his misery. So perhaps you're in the process of discovery, process of finding yourself in, in some way. Maybe in a relationship or out of a relationship. Maybe it's in your work life. But maybe there's a resolution here to be yourself more, to be more authentic. And the Six of Wands. Nothing great was ever achieved without enthusiasm. So there is success, victory here with enthusiasm backing it up. Powerful. It's been wonderful to read for you today. Take care, stay blessed, and I'll talk to you again soon. Bye for now.